It's official. We're leaving Canada. This is our first time doing this. <laughs> Pleasant experience. It feels like it, like you're getting a needle into your eyeball. Thank you for being gentle. <laughs> Oh, that hurt. <laughs> oh, it's like watery. I'm not crying, I swear. How'd, how'd you do? Oh, my eyes were just tearing up. My eyes were wanting so bad. <laughs> it wasn't that painful as I thought. It's just very yeah, comfortable. Just the first little bit. It's like stabbing into your like eyeball braid. <laughs> I just started like just tears just dropping down. I'm like, I swear. I'm, I'm, I'm not crying. We survived our first COVID test. Hopefully we're not positive. Negative is good. Where are we going? Where are we gonna fly tomorrow? To Finland! Yes! Okay, so let me explain what's happening here. Toronto has had the longest lockdown anywhere in North America with restaurants and gyms and other things being closed for over 300 days. And I'm all for doing my part and taking this seriously. We have been taking it very seriously. But then more recently, I feel like the politicians in Canada have just really gone overboard and just gone away from the science. And they started closing things like golf courses and tennis courts and skate parks. There's literally a paid guy to look over the skate park to make sure nobody gets in. And I'm pretty sure nobody's getting COVID from playing tennis like 20, 30 feet away from each other. They even said they were gonna close down playgrounds and that cops would be able to pull over anybody they wanted on the road. And that's when I think things started to get a little bit ahead and people got pretty mad about that one and they quickly reversed it. So some of you know that I'm actually a dual citizen and my other home country is Finland and they have done much better with COVID. So we're gonna take all the precautions, we're gonna do the test, we're gonna quarantine, we're gonna wear a mask, we're gonna do everything we can, and we're gonna head to Finland because it's gonna be a lot safer and a lot more free for my family. Wasn't easy making that decision. Definitely stressed about that a lot, but I think it's what's best for the family right now. It's time to find out if I have COVID. Princess, birth date. All right, princess, do you have COVID? Not detected. You're COVID free. <laughs> I believe that is a good thing. All right, princess is cleared. Imagine I had COVID, I couldn't go. Not detected, yes! <laughs> Finland, here we come. Just got this for my camera. I don't know if you know what that is, but I'm very excited to try it out. Kai, you excited to test it out? Yeah. Yeah. Are you more excited to just get on the airplane? <laughs> yeah. It's so much oh my gosh, this is the first time traveling with two kids and it's already crazy. Right, Kaya? Yeah, there's so much stuff in here. <laughs> I just realized the microphone broke. That's not good, no. man. This is our car. Tetris at its finest. Oh, can't believe we're actually maybe gonna fit everything. Oh, this is stressful. Sorry for the bad audio now. Road, I'm gonna, gonna need a new microphone. <laughs> Kai, you ready? Yay! Coco, ready? Moment of truth. Does it close? I'm gonna guess no. I don't know his name yet, but he's the man. <laughs> <laughs> he's making it happen. Okay. Thank you so Bye. much. We made it. Oh. Can you believe it? We actually made it. We gotta get inside, right? We gotta get a cart. That's quite the pile right there. I've never traveled with this much luggage. Stresses me out, but um, Kai, you want to push this one? You got it? No, I think so. no, I got this. I got this. Crazy how quiet it is in here. Usually, this would be like rammed with people, jammed with people over there. All of these aisles would be full of people. Now, there's nobody here. Frankfurt, here we come. Almost disaster already. 
dropped my camera off the luggage. I thought it broke. No. I thought it was like the, the microphone was all busted up back here. The plug wouldn't go in anymore. Well, it's a good, thing. I, good thing we got backup. But I got it snapped back in and I think uh, it's just a little damage on the lead, but... <laughs> Hey, it's just a sign of good content. Oh yeah, content, content, <laughs> content. Oh, I don't want any, any, no more content like that. We've had enough fails with cameras. <laughs> Isn't it crazy being at the airport and it's this empty? This is a dream, guys. <laughs> it's a good time to travel right now. <laughs> Nobody's here. Uh, but yeah, yeah, but you can call once we, um, well, once you get there. Huh. Oh, so right now the situation just, is. Just went real stressful. I need to get documents proving that Hey, the worst case situation, happen. they'll put you on a flight tomorrow. That's what he said, but right now we didn't, they, it doesn't say anywhere, but apparently we need a, a marriage certificate and birth certificate because they don't have finished passports. Family's allowed, but they don't have finished passports, so Lufthansa, I guess, will say, like, or could say, you guys can't come on this flight. So now we got my brother-in-law going to our house real quickly to take photos of, our, of the doctor and send them over. We have like half an hour and then the flight closes. If they don't get on the plane, I think Van and I just have to go to the cottage on our own. Yeah. <laughs> Hot tubbing time, just the two of us. Nightmare scenario. It, it's good to just take photos of them and been fine, but they didn't say anywhere to have them. Ah. I don't know, they get those. We'll do this, things. we'll get this, we'll get this. Julian's gonna save the day. Julian's gonna save it. Thanks, Julian, in advance. Order him some desserts. And <laughs> <laughs> we owe you big time. Quick update. Uh, my brother-in-law is just parking the car. We got, I think, 17. We got 17 more minutes. Hopefully, we can find these documents. Hoping. There's a white bin. There's just paperwork. There's tons of paperwork inside. No, it's a yellow envelope. What's in the face envelope. Tones? We can't see it. I don't know why it's frozen. Uh, it's the big, big white plastic top uh, bin. Okay, no, you're looking for one of those yellow envelopes? One of the yellow envelopes says personal document. No, that's the wrong one. No, 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 that's the wrong one. Wrong one. Wrong big one. one. That, that one, one, that one, yeah. So let me just take a picture and send you these two right now. Okay. So I said he's not in the way off. I think we got all three. Just waiting for them to come in now. Uh, I think we found him, so he's just sending him over right now. Oh my gosh. Talk about stress. Oh Zero to ten, gosh. how stressed are you feeling right now? I'm a little bit relieved right now because we got them, but holy crap. <laughs> Not how I was expecting the day to go. You seem like you're handling it well. You didn't you didn't break down? Well we can do this. We can get on this player. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, now we're going through this crazy long run to the gate. I think they're already boarding. I've never been this late for a flight. It wasn't our fault. Uh, let's go, go, go. We made it. Oh my goodness, the machine broke and they had to scan each of the milk and oh no. liquids. So Vera and I are going on the flight. Hopefully they get on the flight because uh, <laughs> otherwise we're without a car when we get there. They still haven't got through. I don't know what's going on. These guys, they're getting rusty at traveling. Ver and I, yeah. we're through, we're clear, everything's good. They're still clearing documents. Hopefully they get on the same flight, cause uh, yeah, it'd be good to travel together, not alone. So empty. <laughs> All right, let's go see if they actually even made it on to the plane. I don't know where they are. I'm gonna go see. Hopefully they got on the plane, because otherwise the boss didn't come along with me. Oh, you guys made it on the plane. Yeah. I was I was so like scared that you guys didn't make it on the plane. Oh, yeah. They made it on the plane. They're all we here. Made it. All four. Yeah. Kai, 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 Kai. Kai, you made it on the plane. <laughs> just barely, just barely, oh my god. How relieved are you right now? What a marathon, what a marathon. I can't believe we're here, but we're here, we're on our way. We're gonna be in Finland soon. First Let Germany, then Finland. Less than 24 hours. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. One of the, one of the craziest <laughs> flying experiences. Snagged a few drinks from the lounge real quick while they were scanning every single bottle and formula thing and everything. There's like 20 of them, so took forever. We're here. 
pretty good. One child down there. Second child in here. This, this is the dad life right here. Wow, you you're, you're paving the way for all nomad travelers this, for dads. you see how much I was carrying out of there? <laughs> That's how you get your workout. Welcome to Hezeki, ladies and gentlemen. Please mind the seatbelt sign and stay seated. Need help? We made it to Finland! Freedom! <laughs> Oh, that was a stressful trip, but we are here. Time to grab some cars, head to the cottage. Quarantine time. Here's our first ride. And here's our other one. Uh, thank you, Mercedes, for hooking us up with a nice ride for the family. This will, this will do well. Thanks, guys. Ooh, this is a little nicer than your average rental car. <laughs> thank you, Mercedes, Finland. Oh, feels good to get this thing off. Whew. Got my ride. Let's go. Kai Kai. How does it feel to be Finland? Oh, I missed you too. Even though it's for like 20 minutes. Well, maybe a little more. Oh, I missed you too, Coco. Oh, that's a bear. <laughs> we got to get in the car, Kai. Come on. We survived. Just barely. Just got everything in the car. Kai, you ready to go? <laughs> Toy from the mall, okay. All right, last leg of the race. <laughs> Quick little pit stop, get some food, feed the kids. Kai, you excited? We're almost there. Yeah. So close. Not yet? You just want to keep traveling? Yeah. You just want to keep going? Yeah. <laughs> this thing has been quite the uh, smooth ride. Lane detection, keeping me going nice and smooth and comfortable. Here. I see that one better right there. It's this one. I think we're here. Oh, it's hideous. <laughs> Absolutely hideous. This, it's right here. Hideous thing right here. Hideous. <laughs> yeah, it's so big. You wanna see it, buddy? Not red. Let's go look. This way. This is where we're gonna be staying, Kai. Oh, heck. yes. Views for days. This is a good place to quarantine right here. Oh my gosh. This looks beautiful. So nice. This one's great because it has their private dock. Oh man. Little robo, you know, in Finland we don't use motorboats, we just use rowboats. Meanwhile, the motorboat just went by. <laughs> Kai, what do you think, buddy? Is it nice? Yeah. I think we will survive quarantining just fine. I think there's only one thing left to do today. It's like. 10.30 at night, sunset just keeps getting better and better. This is the best part about Finland, that the golden hour lasts for hours, hours. You get this insane light. It was, it was already looking like, oh, we're gonna lose it. And then it just came back with these <laughs> insane colors. Oh, I love this place. So nice to be back in Finland. Looking forward to filming more here. Against all odds, we actually made it. <laughs> I didn't think we were gonna make it up. <laughs> oh, that was nuts. Craziness. Oh my goodness. Okay, are you excited? Yeah. We're going on the airplane now. <laughs> 